<laughs> Welcome to Build. I'm your host, Mona Assange. And I'm here today with the, with chatting with the, all the 15 queens from the new season of RuPaul's Drag Race, premiering February 28th on VH1. It's set to be the most fashionable, fearless, and jaw-dropping spectacle in Drag Race history. Let's take a look at the trailer. RuPaul's Drag Race is back, 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 back again. And it's bigger than ever. She better match that way. That this season you'll be saying, oh my way. No. All right, y'all ready to meet these queens? <laughs> Akira Davenport. Babies. Ariel Versace. Yeah. Brooklyn Heights, Honey Davenport, Oh, Honey, <laughs> Kahana Montrese, Mercedes Iman Diamond. She knows she's a cute girl, but there's nothing more than that. You know what you love her? It's Nina West, Alexis Michelle, Plastic Tiara. Oh my god. She's a woman! It's Raja O'Hara. <laughs> Scarlet Envy. That man is having a good time. She's real sweet, honey. It's Miss Sugar Cane. She's everything I want to be when I'm 57. And of course, we have Miss Silky Nutmeg Ganache. There's no doubt. That she's supposed to be here. <laughs> Make some noise for Soju! And we have Miss Vanessa Vanji. Miss <laughs> Miss Miss Vanji. Time with me, Michelle. Miss Vanji. Vanji. Miss Vanji. Miss <laughs> Evie Oddly. <laughs> well, you girls look good. <laughs> How do you ladies feel today? It's been a very long day, yeah? Oh, yeah. we feel oh. amazing. Oh. Hello. Long this day. Is the, I can't hear day. myself. That Hello. We actually have been waiting for what seems like eight years. Yeah. Hello. Eight Welcome months. to season 11. <laughs> we almost funny. had a baby. Right. Yeah, it's been a while. Who had a baby? I did. I'm still pregnant. Triple the child of season 11. Taco Bell, Burger King, and McDonald's about to come out Woo! right now. <laughs> Yo, shut the hell up. <laughs> <laughs> I came up with my first drag day. Which was? Lasagna Frozen. <laughs> <laughs> yes! I saw Jaden Dior Fierce. If she could get on, like Gia Gunn said. There's room for everybody. Let's just say that. I auditioned nine times. Nine. <laughs> Whoa! Did you? Because I'm old. And I'm the first yeah, Canadian yeah, on the show. The government of Canada tweeted me. And it was like, congratulations. <laughs> I couldn't believe it. And then like a conservative politician was like, well, why are we supporting a drag queen? And But we can't do blackface. And I was like, oh. You cannot do blackface because that is not, not okay. And why oh. has not, why the mayor of Dallas has not tweeted about the three girls Hello. representing Hello. Dallas? Why are you talking? Hello? We get it. And Mercedes is the first Muslim drag queen. Yeah. Well, I am also the first um, Christian drag queen, <laughs> single and mingling on crystalmingle.com. Could you shut up a second? Y'all better enjoy that too. honey baked ham. <laughs> but you know, like. Who did you think was your biggest competition? Evie, because I worked with her before and I know what she brings. Oh, she's sending everyone home. Let me stay on my game. I right will back. say, for me, um, knowing that. Shut up! Shut up! And we're both sickening. What? Who said that? <laughs> I walked into a workroom full of beautiful Somebody women. Right. Yeah, Where's the camera? Where's camera it? zooming on plastic. Why'd you like? There you go. <laughs> Just like that. Let me introduce you to my friend. <laughs> what really scared the shit out of me was the pageant girls, because you know how yeah. fierce they are. You look over, I was like, 
Okay. Oh, this season we have Mateos, we have Edwards, we have Davenport's, we have all, like, all these connections. Montreses. Oh, Montreses. Yeah, Montreses. Yeah, sorry, sorry, Coco, I love you. I think the drag race is a journey that we all take for ourselves individually. Anybody who wants to put their art on this platform is, is not really just doing it because of the legacy that they're from, but because of the art that they want to create in the future. One thing is like, for me, like my drag is so personal that I feel like it's my baby. So it was kind of like <laughs> intimidating. <laughs> Alyssa. One of the most popular queens to ever come out of Drag Race. And she and I are very different. You know, I'm representing the house of Edwards. I mean, the house, I, the, 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 the house down boots. New York is, a cra is crazy because it has literally, I'm sorry y'all, but the best queens in the country. Like, they're Absolutely. so fierce. I'm excited to represent the BK and uh, show my versatility, mm -hmm. if you know what I mean. Do y'all think season 11 is going to give us some good memes? Oh, 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 yeah. Yeah. Wait, what is Mimi? Yeah, with my cooking. Oh, no, I wasn't gone awful. Now. I wasn't awful. Why, what'd she do? No, this season is definitely delivering on the memes, on the shade, on all the everything that you want. Shade. Well, you got the you got the <laughs> queen of too, meme right you know. here, Vanji, in the season, so uh, you know you're gonna get the meme. Yes, yes, there yes. You go. Listen, that was accidental. <laughs> so we ain't. I don't even. Huh? Can we say it together? One, two, three. <laughs> All right, we ain't doing that again. <laughs> what do you think that you bring, that you possess, that is the extra accoutrement that makes you America's Next Drag Superstar? For real. I would like to... Go ahead. What makes my drag America's Next Drag Superstar drag is that I just use my voice as a platform for other people who don't have one, for women, for people of color. Mine always has a message. I think that that is something that I project into the world that I don't really see a lot of queens doing today. <gasps> I am America's Next Drag Superstar because I own every inch of my body. And this pop culture phenomenon can impact and uh, make tremendous effect on many other lives other than my own or these girls sitting on stage. Yeah. And shout out I'm to Nina West. She's raised over $2 million for charity. Oh, oh my God. Wait. Wow. Well, for me personally, I just want to, um, you know, I feel like, who, who, who's the Kiki? I also learned from the queens that has come before us as well. Um, I turned 21 in April of last year, so I barely passed the limit. Come on, baby. <laughs> right. <laughs> yeah, same. <laughs> well, yeah, I have all of that. I, plus. I mean, I, th plus. I think it should be said. I mean, I think, I think it should be said. We're gonna read some some comments from some fans, and you guys just just react to them, okay? No offense, but protect Silky Nutmeg Ganache at all costs. But like, but you know, we, yes, one hundred percent. It's your business to watch it, but it's not your business to take it to Silky, Work. to me, to Vanjie. Your job is to enjoy it. But I swear to God, if I see a death threat, Mom, I'm gonna show up in your bedroom. And Let's yeah. Your mother scrubs docks in hell. But Silky is somebody who is confident. She's actually know who she is. So those comments roll right off her back, right off those rolls. Back roll. Yeah. Right ah. the ah. Somebody the trying word? to book me the for fifty dollars and I professionally decline. But that's honey, all right. That's all right. You can't book me for fifty dollars and I look like boo. this. Monet. <laughs> <laughs> but we clapping back tonight. Thank you. Thank you so much. I thought um, we was written on hate. I think I. I think it's. We have two Asian girls this season, and... Asians have such a stereotype that we have to break, you know? And we're given this, like, Asian guys are not, you know, not sexy, and we're just nerds, and we're, you know, usually, like, very conservative and things like that, and it's important. We're none of that, you know? And I'm fabulous and gay, and, you know, like, I... Work. I'm proud of who I am, and I just want to show that the Asian kids out there, you guys can do this too. You guys can put on a wig. You guys can go on, you know, YouTube. You can drink soju, and you know, you can like be on RuPaul's Drag Race. Without revealing too much, tell us the elimination order. <laughs> no, I'm kidding. Uh... <laughs> RuPaul is over there right now, looking at us. Turn your volumes down for this one, but it's gonna be. <laughs> yeah. Listen, yes. let me say something. You could be in a room with 99 people. <laughs> if one person one. believe in you, uh -huh. the 98 don't matter. Don't matter. Because it's 99 uh -huh. minus one is 98. Hey. That person believe in you, you could get into the stars born. Hey. <laughs> Ha, <laughs> ha,
Yes. Mama, it's going to be yeah. gaggy, but less produced. <gasps> no, I'm just kidding. Oh, <laughs> no, no, I mean, you guys experience oh, good time. It's going to be no. Oh, go ahead. Go ahead. Make some for the cast of season 11. Oh.